Imagine the kind of person who can afford a yacht that comes with a basketball court, a diving and fishing center, and not one, but two margarita makers. You guessed it right, it's none other than the legendary Michael Jordan. From his successful career in basketball, including the famous movie Space Jam, to his remarkable net worth, Michael Jordan lives a life of luxury and extravagance. Today, we will delve into the world of Michael Jordan's incredible yachts, exploring their remarkable features, jaw-dropping costs, and discovering how MJ spends his time aboard. Despite being an iconic figure for over three decades, Jordan has managed to retain a significant amount of privacy. He values his personal space, and who can blame him? Privacy is a priceless asset that once lost cannot be regained. Just like you've never seen my face, Jordan has been successful in keeping his private life away from prying eyes. But today, we'll uncover some fascinating details about his beloved yachts that showcase his opulent lifestyle. Mr. Terrible Let's start with the yacht known as Mr. Terrible, which is anything but terrible. This magnificent vessel has long been associated with Michael Jordan and has been off-limits for chartering for several years. With its impressive length of 154 feet, equivalent to one and a half basketball courts, Mr. Terrible offers a range of 2,700 nautical miles, allowing Jordan to effortlessly explore the Caribbean for days on end. But what truly sets this yacht apart are its luxurious features. On the flybridge, you'll find not only an open steering station, but also an entire entertainment and relaxation area that exudes opulence. Imagine soaking in a hot tub just a few steps away from a wet bar. Pure bliss. And if that's not enough, there's a retractable 50-inch plasma screen TV that gives you the choice between enjoying the tropical views or catching up on Space Jam. No need to worry about finding the remote while lounging in the hot tub, as it's waterproof and floats within easy reach. Now, that's what I call the epitome of luxury. The outdoor experience continues on the aft deck where you can savor alfresco dining, and on the main deck, where a fishing cockpit awaits fishing enthusiasts like Jordan. For those who want to dive into adventure, there's even a dive center equipped with all the necessary gear. The interior of Mr. Terrible is a visual delight, tastefully decorated in a unique blend of Polynesian style and art deco touches. Numerous entertaining areas, including a spacious dining saloon, provide a warm and inviting atmosphere for up to 14 guests. And don't miss the spiral staircase, a true work of art crafted with bobinga and stainless steel. So, it's safe to say that Mr. Terrible lives up to its name as one of the most incredible yachts out there. Joy! But let's move on to the grandest of them all, the yacht that truly brings joy to its owner, Michael Jordan. Priced at a staggering $80 million, Joy is a name that perfectly matches what this yacht offers. Measuring an astounding 229 feet in length, Joy outshines Mr. Terrible and any other yacht in any harbor. This relatively new vessel, built in 2016, boasts five decks filled with layers of luxury and surprises waiting to be discovered. Now, prepare yourself for the ultimate highlight, the basketball court located on the fourth deck. This court provides the ideal setting for Jordan to showcase his skills and enjoy some quality time with his kids. Just imagine sailing through the Caribbean and playing a game of basketball while surrounded by the sparkling blue waves. Truly magical. But Joy doesn't stop at basketball. The four deck can be converted into a game stack for various sports like badminton and football, showcasing the yacht's versatility and adaptability to indoor and outdoor living. With glass enclosures on the fore deck and all three aft decks, you can enjoy the entire ship no matter the weather. The indoor spaces are bathed in natural light, thanks to the sliding glass doors. So, while Michael's wife relaxes in the lounge with a drink, she can still engage with her kids on the basketball court. Talk about the best of both worlds. The game deck seamlessly connects to the owner's pavilion. Featuring a stunning master suite with panoramic water views, his and hers bathrooms, an owner's office, and a private owner's lounge. Absolute privacy even when friends are on board. Speaking of friends, Joy offers ample guest accommodations, with seven cabins, including two VIP staterooms, four double cabins, and a twin cabin. 
comfortably accommodating up to 12 guests. The bathrooms in each cabin exude elegance with granite accents and rainfall showers, creating a spa-like experience. And yes, Joy has an actual spa on board, complete with a jacuzzi sauna and a dedicated treatment room for massages and facials. You'll find dozens of living areas and lounges throughout the yacht, but the main lounge steals the spotlight. With its bar and custom furniture adorned in warm colors, this cozy yet luxurious space is perfect for unwinding. For an exceptional outdoor experience, head to one of the aft decks, where a jacuzzi and sitting area await, accompanied by a convenient wet bar. But wait, there's more! Picture this, you're hundreds of miles offshore on Joy, and you want to let loose on a Saturday night. Don't worry, just hop onto the elevator and make your way to the beach club. This dedicated entertainment space comes to life with its convertible flooring and mesmerizing disco lights, transforming into your private club on the open sea. And when the hangover from the night before hits you the next day, relax in the cinema room with video walls and cozy beanbag chairs, perfect for indulging in movies or video games. But if that's not enough, Joy provides an array of water toys and equipment, ensuring that every guest on board is entertained, from inflatables and water skis to fishing and scuba gear. So, it's safe to say that nobody will ever experience boredom aboard this incredible vessel. So, which yacht caught your attention? Which one did you find the most captivating? Do you think Michael Jordan actually owns these yachts, or is he merely chartering them for a show? Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. And remember, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like, subscribe to our channel, and turn on post notifications to stay up to date with our latest content. Thank you for watching, and as always, act fast because opportunities like these come once in a lifetime. Excuse me, I need to shoot some hoops. Till next time!